Hi, I'm Dr. Evan Matthews. I'm here at Montclair State University in the Exercise Science Lab to show you how to use a typical office scale. So this is um, from the brand Detecto and uh, it functions just like all the others. So we'll show you real quickly how to do that now. All right, so once you're ready to weigh somebody or something, you have them step onto the scale and then you start to move these black weights across the uh, beam of this scale. All right, so you're going to start with the bigger weight first and as you're moving it, you notice there's sort of a point on this left side. That point is what you're trying to line up with the weight on the beam here. All right, so the top is pounds, the bottom is kilograms. I'm going to do pounds today just because that's what most of the students watching this are going to be um, using. So I'm going to move this to, we'll go ahead and say, say about 150 pounds. So right there, I'm at 150 pounds. You can see, if you look closely, this, this beam, isn't level still, so it's still sort of weighing too much on this side, which means what's on this scale right now weighs more than 150 pounds. So before we adjust this smaller increment, let's go ahead and bump this up one more notch and see what happens. So I'm going to go from 150 pounds to 200 pounds. If you notice there, now the weight, or now the scale is leaning on this side, which means what's on the scale weighs less than 200 pounds, but more than 150 pounds. So I'm going to bump this back to 150. So again, we're now we're leaning, the scale's leaning more on this side, and I'm going to start adjusting this smaller black weight. All right, so the smaller black weight um, is going to work just like the, the bigger one where there's these two different um, number scales. The top is pounds, the bottom is kilograms. It's just doing much smaller increments. So I'm at 20 pounds of added weight for this top here and it's leaning all the way on this side here which tells me 20 plus 150 170 this is this what's on the scale right now weighs under 170 pounds so i'm going to try to move back move to 118 and now it's weighing on the other side so i'm somewhere between um sorry that was 18 so 168 so somewhere between 168 pounds and 170 pounds so let's move it ever so slightly over we're still weighing a little too much on this side, so we're at 169 pounds right now. So we're probably just shy of 170 pounds. There we go. So now it's balanced. You, if you look on this side, this side of the scale isn't touching the top or the bottom part of this white metal, which means there's nothing weighing too much on one side or the other of this balance. All right, so this is now what the weight of this uh, object on the scale is. So it is about 169, 169 and a half pounds. So that's all you do to use one of these scales. Now to um, reset it for the next person or just to have it in sort of a uh, ready state for the next person, you're just gonna bring these two weights back over and there you go, it's ready for the next person. All right, so that was a really quick demonstration on how to use one of these kind of doctor's office style scales. I hope it was helpful. Uh, put any questions you have in the comments below and I'll try to answer those questions and come back for another video. Thanks.